Hello and welcome to another unboxing. Today with a TCG I'm not usually opening. It's Battle Spirits and yeah, the original, not Battle Spirits Saga. It's the Japanese Battle Spirits. Uh, yeah, this is one of the older sets. I, I did open like a collaboration set with Neon Genesis and Battle Spirits once because I'm really big into Neon Genesis Evangelion. But yeah, this one I bought because of a different reason. And if you know me and my channel, you can probably already tell like from this picture. It's because there are like some heavily ancient Egyptian inspired artworks in this set. So yeah, I'm really hoping to, to get them because there are actually a lot, like a lot of releases and sets in Battle Spirits that have uh, artworks with ancient Egyptian style, but yeah, most of the the boxes are already sold out, or yeah, at least I cannot get them. But I found one last box from this release in a shop and ordered it, of course. And yeah, maybe yeah, one day I will try to to pick up all of the single cards. I I don't know how I will ever be able to pick them all up because there are just so many. And because I'm stuck here in, in Germany and it's not so easy to find sellers for, for single cards. But yeah, let's try to to pull as much as we can from this box. There are many cards in a pack. Yo, okay. <laughs> and yeah, the cards are unfortunately, they are small. They are Yu-Gi-Oh size. Not like uh, Battle Spirit Saga. Battle Spirit Saga is like Pokemon size and I really like it about... Uh, about the game that they changed the size because I'm not a fan of these small cards. I I don't like them a lot. Oh, we start with the M rarity. Oh, I actually don't know which are like the highest ones. Maybe we have like an overview. Of course, I throw the box away. It looks like they have... Uh, a rarity overview, but of course it's in Japanese. And I don't get it. <laughs> so yeah, not sure how, how rare this is supposed to be. But yeah, the first foil card has like some gold stamped bordering, which looks cool. Some textured border and the, the artwork itself is not like textured or anything. So yeah, maybe if you, you are familiar to Battle Spirits or you, you know a place where I can order cards to, and they ship to, to Europe, I uh, would be very thankful. Okay, this is already an artwork that I love. Oh, this is so cool. Oh, and I, yeah, I don't know all of the artworks. I just know that these, this set has... But I, I haven't looked at all the... Oh, this is so cool. So we have like these jewelry and the, the necklace and stuff, which looks super uh, Egyptian style. And there are also like hieroglyphs on the book. And there is like this uh, Ibis, is the name, I think. Uh, very important animal. There's also like a, a deity, like uh, how it's pronounced, Thoth. Thoth, Thoth, I think. It's like an Ibis looking uh, god. We also have like a. Uh, what was the name of the, the ape? I don't know actually, but okay. Oh, I love this. I don't really fully understand what's going on, but it looks like this is the past like a few thousand years ago and this is like the future because it looks like he's building py uh, pyramids there like it looks like sci-fi oh this is so cool double-sided oh i love this artwork this is so beautiful yeah man this is like already already really worth it it's sorry if i take too long <laughs> I expect not many people just are as excited as I am. 
Oh, it's like an otter. He looks a bit sad. What's going on? But yeah, I'm I'm just super excited about these these artworks, and I <laughs> I just want to take my time. And we've got another. They're like a hit in every pack. And X rarity this time. Not double sided, but this one has a lot of texture on it. That's so cool. Maybe I. Maybe I'm missing out on something, but there are just too many TCGs I would love to open and yeah, uh, not enough money. That's that's the sad part. So cool. Yeah, the the art styles or like the the world building in Battle Spirits is like all over the place. We have like this futuristic like these robot uh, penguins. And then there are like ancient looking uh, characters. Again, it's a double sided. Maybe the bird here was double sided too? No. I have to check the name. Maybe the name has something to do with like Horus or with like Neptis. So like one uh, like inspired by, by ancient Egypt too. But we get like in the lower rarities, like we are getting some duplicates. So I will go a little bit faster. <laughs> what is this? Like a shark with boobs? Scary. But what? <laughs> what's going on? Another. What's the rarity? I don't know the rarity. Maybe it's just a just a regular parallel foil or something. Looks like a cold foiling. It's uh, the foiling is very similar. Maybe you know my zillions of enemy X unboxings, and there are like these revolution rare and the L LG rares. I'm always complaining a little bit because I I'm not the the biggest fan of the <laughs> of the foiling type because it makes the card looking pretty dark, it's like a dodo in space. <laughs> oh, this is so weird, man. This is so weird. Got a rare card and foil. And a double foil card. Oh, 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 oh. So the front side has no texture. It looks like a regular parallel foil. On the back, we've got like a X rare with like texture and everything. But yeah, I'm not big into uh, robots or like these Gundam character styles. Like I. I like Code GS and Neon Genesis Evangelion, but yeah, this this was it. Like I, I'm not big into to robots, to be honest. Unfortunately, not. This is like the the fourth time we see this wolf. Another. Now I have I have to turn over the cards always to see what's behind them. But yeah, I don't think there were like m more field boxes around this release. Oh, and this is um, what's the English word? Platibus? Like the. Uh, I know the German name, but that's not helping. The Australian egg laying uh, animal. <laughs> oh, this looks like a yokai, like a kitsune. Cool. What is this? Looks like a, a samurai raptor. Ah, I was hoping for for another artwork on the back. Yeah, this looks like a samurai uh, samurai dinosaur. <laughs> it's always like so so funny to open these these TCGs where you don't know what to expect and. I'm not fully getting the the whole picture of the world building and in battle spirits. Looks like they are putting a lot of different stuff together. Now this gives me like some vampire vibes. Not sure. Vampires in space is this a thing? I don't know. Yeah, 
Yeah, I will try to to pick up more boxes if I if I can find them and if I have the money. This is actually way more fun fun than I expected. I have to check this card. Maybe maybe this has a ancient Egyptian name too. No, oh no, backside. Now I'm always <laughs> a little bit disappointed if there is no backside. Oh, this one has it. What is it? It's hard to to tell what I'm seeing. And again, the the artist is working with the the contrast and the background of a full moon. Not sure how to describe this one, but looks interesting too. Another Dodo out of space. Uh, what is this? Like an angel character? Okay, we get another X-Rare. Uh, but I, I hope I can pull like an X-Rare of one of the Egyptian ones. I think there, there was a, some kind of Horus maybe? Or Osiris? Not sure. But yeah, these X-Rare cards, they feel so good with the texture. Just don't know how many are there in a box. Here we now we've got like a laser space turtle. Another rare. Oh, and another X. Sometimes these are hard to read. Similar to like dual masters. They're like very cool high rarity cards in dual masters, and sometimes there is like a, yeah. A middle crown missing like something for the eye to fixate on like there's just too much going on so many so much details and yeah it's getting a bit difficult to read the art just for me another angel okay this looks cool a bit dark again and on the back is just a snake but yeah, no texture for this one. Maybe she's some kind of Medusa character. But there's also like a a snake in ancient Egyptian Egyptian uh, history, or like uh, yeah. Just don't remember the name. Oh, and this looks like a Triceratops knight. Again, very dark. Oh yeah, and here we have like the, the regular Triceratops, cool. With like horns and yeah, it looks like uh, like swords. That's cool. Two more packs, so please just uh, just another X rare with like Egyptian artwork would be nice. It's not. What is it? Like a sword? Oh, this is another textured hit. Oh, this looks cool. Yeah, I cannot say a lot about the different rarities. Maybe for the future, if I, if I will be opening another box, I will do some more research. I wasn't expecting that it's, it's actually so cool looking. And you get like quite a quite a big amount of hits, but yeah. Uh, no more, no more Egyptian artwork, sadly. But yeah, this this artwork looks very very cool. Really like this one. I like the the ancient version more than the the modern version. I really like this one. So let's end this with a. Was a real pack and yeah for more unboxings please check out my channel subscribe if you haven't yet or yeah forget, uh, don't forget to to like the video should have probably said it in the beginning to like the video but anyway see you in my next unboxing bye